Hello, I am Tululi. <laughs> Welcome back. Today's reading comes from r slash there was an attempt. Let's see how many attempts were made. <laughs> you know, just like my attempt to say something funny there and it completely failed. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? <laughs> I'm slowly losing my mind, but at least you're here to experience it. Anyways, if you haven't joined the Discord yet, the link is in the description below. Please come by, say hello, make some friends. And yeah, just, uh, yeah, do that. <laughs> Do that. I'd love to see you. Anyways, uh, let's get started. Why isn't my mouse working? <laughs> oh, I get it, because it's not an actual mouse. Because it's an effing hamster. <laughs> no, that's not, that's not the reason either. It's not... <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, I get it. Like, it's not a mouse, it's a hamster. Yes, that's true, but that's not the reason why it's not working, obviously. We all know this, right? Am I taking this too literal? Is, is this a whoosh moment for me? When the Daily Wire called out Patton Oswalt, a supposed comedian, Oswalt responded with, Guys, if you're gonna write an article about me being a failed comedian, maybe don't use a pic of me holding up the Emmy I won for doing comedy. <laughs> That's kind of funny though. That's if that's true. That's yeah. That's uh, I expect more. Would you rather have thirty million dollars or thirty million thirty 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 million loyal friends? <laughs> the f am I gonna do with thirty million friends? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I get, well, yeah, that's true, actually, yeah, like, 30 million is a lot of people. You wouldn't even have enough time to hang out with all of them. You'd have to, like, be on a stage or something. Actually, you can't even, how would you even communicate with 30 million people? I don't know, without them, like, how, how do you have a personal connection with them? I don't know, anyway, we'll have to figure it out. Let's get the channel to 30 million subscribers, and we'll figure out how we can all be friends. I sell my meow for $1,000. What am I? <laughs> Overcharging by 960. <laughs> Oh, wow. Is that really the going rate? It's 40 bucks? <laughs> My goodness. I don't know why that matters, though. Why should I care? I worked at Forever 21 as a cashier, and I guess the customer I rang up was an IG baddie because a few people recognized her, but I didn't. And when I checked her out, she was like, this line is so long. Do you know who I am? And I said, S uh, no, sorry. And then her card declined for $1.35. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, um, clout and exposure. Don't pay the bills. Remember this, people. Amtrak. California, do not follow where the path may lead. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. Ralph Emmert, with all due respect, this is terrible advice for trains. I feel like we've seen this before. This is old. <laughs> this is this is old. We've seen we've seen the Amtrak one before, and uh, yes, it's true. You should not be a train that's going off a path. Uh, okay, effing keep it. <laughs> <laughs> when you get the lock on your wheel. <laughs> the ticket costs more than the value of the car to get it removed. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. It's like, you can just keep this piece of crap. Uh, I bet I bet the I bet whoever put the, 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 the lock on the tire actually has to pay more to then go back out there, take it off, and then move the vehicle. Or they'll probably just leave it there and the person comes back and just doesn't care because they have Sharpie on their car. Everyone shut the F up. I got accepted for a NASA internship. Language. Suck my donger and balls. I'm working at NASA. And I'm on the National Space Council that oversees NASA. <laughs> Uh oh, girl loses NASA internship after insulting engineer. <laughs> oh, you know, that's just how the internet is, though. It's just a lot of disrespectful people that say like really bad things, and it's kind of cool to see someone actually, you know, it's kind of kind of nice to see some instant karma. You know what I'm saying? The president of Ireland always has his dong around him. <laughs> I think he meant dog, <laughs> but I would also hope he has his dong with him as well, because that's kind of a thing you don't want to lose. <laughs> I guess some people might nowadays, but uh, okay. I took a photo of two plump pigeons perched on the ledge, but ended up getting a photo of two massive pigeons looking for their car. <laughs> oh, um, wait, what? Uh, wait, oh, oh, I get it because of the perspective. They're probably on a ledge, but then the ledge blends in with the, uh, the, the parking lot below them, and then it makes them look like giant pigeons. I get it. It took me a second for it to click. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I'm slow, people. I'm sorry. Mithridates the sixth was so paranoid of being poisoned that he took small doses throughout his life to build up an immunity. When he was finally captured by the Romans, he tried to kill himself with poison, but failed because he was immune. <laughs> oh, that, that didn't work out too well in your favor, did it? But you shouldn't be taking your own life anyways. Although the Romans would probably torture you in a terrible way. 
probably want to go out before then because either way you're going out i guess i understand that but uh oh well i mean you couldn't you couldn't tell the future right you didn't know you were going to be captured by the romans okay what's going on here looks like a robbery a man walked into a louisiana circle k put a 20 dollars bill on the counter and asked for change when the clerk opened the cash drawer the man pulled a gun and asked for all the cash in the register which the clerk promptly provided the man took the cash from the clerk and fled leaving the 20 dollars bill on the counter the total amount of cash he got from the drawer was 15 dollars <laughs> Oh my gosh. And now you go to prison for 10 or 15 years for armed robbery over $15. <laughs> you came out with less than you went in, man. Not smart. I'm a very private person. You don't ask, I don't tell. So who asked you this? <laughs> this is a good point. <laughs> this is a very good point. Well, well done. In high school, I was dared to play gay chicken, which is where two straight guys pretend to be gay and the first one to chicken loses out. Out, chicken out loses. Sorry. <laughs> the other guy and I are both really stubborn, and neither of us, neither one of us wanted to lose. We've been married 14 years, and we run a bed and breakfast in Vermont with, <laughs> with our adopted daughter. If that dude doesn't chicken out soon, I'm going to start to suspect that he's actually gay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, that's a, that's a way of, uh, if, if you're afraid of coming out, you can just say you're playing gay chicken with your friend and everyone will be like, oh, okay, that makes sense. It's like, hey, you guys, you're, you're, you're making out in the hallway. I know, it's, no one's given up yet. They're like, oh, okay, wow, you guys, you guys are really, you guys are really trying, you're just trying to win this, huh? <laughs> <laughs> We've all, we, there you go. That's a solution now. If you can't come out because your parents are going to be crazy or whatever, then no, this is the way you can do it. Why are the police called 12? 9 plus 1 plus 1. That's 11. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, that's not 12. Oh, that's too funny. <laughs> that's, that is funny. This person in their do-it-yourself tattoo. So I got my first tattoo, home jab. <laughs> oh, it's a Star of David. Why did you get the Star of David tattooed on you? You never strike me as a religious person. It's a pentagram. <laughs> Penta five points. Yours has six, which makes it a Star of David. I'm sorry, what? The devil works hard, <laughs> but Jesus won this round. <laughs> oh, oh, epic fail. <laughs> Oh, that's sad. Oh, look, it's a light in bat. Hey, I made a Batman call light. Here it is, and I shine it on the wall, and it does nothing because the light just goes around it and doesn't portray the bat symbol. So I'm going to throw it in the trash. <laughs> oh, that's sad. You, ch you imagine how excited you were when you when you put all that together, and when you shine it against the wall, it doesn't work the way you thought it would. Oh, man, that's, I'm sorry. Every life has worth. Okay, baby cow, pig, fish, chickens. Yes, they are precious lives, not meals. Holds fish out of water. <laughs> That's true, I just realized that. You're holding the fish out of water in your hand, which means you're probably killing it and it's suffering. Way to go. Which addiction is yours? Oh, it's all the social media in the form of pills. Wait, Photoshop is an addiction? Okay. God, I just effing love Uber too much. I cannot stop ordering Ubers to my house and having them drive me to the nearest bus stop and calling another Uber to go to the next one. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I think you missed out though on the Photoshop one because that it's like I feel like the Photoshop would have been more of a more of a thing to to criticize than the Uber. But I don't yeah, I don't think Uber's an addiction either. I guess that's a good point. Oh yeah, look at you bathing in paradise. I wanna do this one day, baby. You can take a bath whenever you want, baby. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> Ah, uh, you gotta be more clear sometimes, all right? You know, us, us guys, we don't uh, we don't take hints too well sometimes. We, there's no reading between the lines, you know. You gotta be straight up with us because uh, if you're not straight up and you and you play that game where we have to try and figure it out, chances are we're gonna get it wrong. Oh yeah, Tony Stark in uh, what looks like an attempt at a liquid metal. Uh, Iron Man. Iron Man statue titled Man of Steel in Italy pays tribute to his death in Endgame. Titled Man of Steel. <laughs> Isn't Man of Steel Superman? <laughs> he's Iron Man, not Steel Man. He's Iron. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Lady Gaga criticizes music pirates with pirated photos. The Shutterstock responds. Can y'all stop? <laughs> we hear you. We like artists to be paid for their work too. <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> a little, a little. Wet. Oh, how the turntables. <laughs> that wasn't thought out very well. Uh, it's time to choose where your loyalties lie with the queer community or with your stomach. Opinion If you really love LGBTQ people, you can't just keep eating Chick fil A. Let's settle it. 99% vote in favor of chicken tendies over rights. 
I mean, it's the internet, of course. It's gonna become a meme and people are gonna vote in the way that you wouldn't think they would vote. No guy has all four. Fast replies, intelligence, good personality, or loyalty. If he had all four of these, why the heck would he date you? <laughs> oh, that's so sad. These people do exist, but uh, they're probably already taken. All right, taking a picture out in the field, okay, with some phone lines. Are you from Paris? Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's not the Eiffel Tower, buddy. <laughs> That's, that is not the Eiffel Tower. Oh my gosh, did you think that was the Eiffel Tower? Oh, that's so sad. That's so sad, I feel terrible. Okay, and you're uh, writing out syntax error. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, you're trying to show that's what the calculator... <laughs> <laughs> that's, not, that, that's definitely not the answer. <laughs> oh, that's funny though. For those of you that use calculators and you see this often, that's, I don't know, that, that tickled me. That tickled me on the inside. What does gold award look like? Oh, you're baiting. It looks like this. <laughs> and there's the gold award. <laughs> that's what you get for trying to bait out the award. <laughs> Someone else got it. Uh, it. There was an attempt though. Definitely. I'll give you that. I'm 15 and already have a fur coat for four grand. And what have you achieved, you losers? My achievement? Not giving a BJ at the age of 15 just to get such a fur coat. I don't think they did that to get the fur coat. I think that their parents probably just have money and they weren't exchanging sexual favors for fur coats. So uh, yeah. But either way, yeah, uh, you. I don't think you achieved it. But who could I? What, who, who am I to say? I don't know. With the internet out there, I don't know. I'm, there's definitely 15 year olds out there that could be hustling and making money with the internet. So, I mean, it's very possible that they earned it, but chances are they probably didn't earn it and they're just trying to flex when they didn't earn their money! Air conditioning is unhealthy, bad, miserable, and sexist. I can't explain how many times I've gotten sick over the summer because of overzealous AC in office. Wait, air conditioning is sexist? What? The majority of men in business settings are wearing multiple layers of clothes to conform to dress code. Put on a freaking cardigan and stop making me ashamed to share a chromosome. <laughs> yeah, I never, really? You, really? We're at that point where, really? <laughs> Air conditioning? Come on! That's just, that's not, that's nonsense. That's, that's ridiculous. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, please like it. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. And if you really enjoyed it, please share it somewhere on the interwebs and leave a comment below. Uh, just say anything. You can literally type anything or something or just, just put a period and push enter. Do something. Because all of those things really help the channel and uh, I really appreciate it. So again, thank you for the continued support. You all are amazing. And if you haven't joined the Discord yet, the link is in the description below. Go check it out. Come by, say hello. Hello, make a friend or two and uh, with that being said we'll see you next time